Um, hello, today I'm going to be showing you how to do the frame of your house. Um, it's really easy. This is what the final finish would look like. Yeah, if you kind of look in there, you can see the frame. I should have added a window, it would have made this easier. But there you go. See right there, right there, there is a down that line that's a stud, and right there, that would be another stud if you know what that is. If you don't know what that is, you should not be watching that vi this video. There's one right there, right there, and this is how I did the lining of my house. Okay, so let's look at a different house frame I'm already starting on. That's just a house frame I've been starting on. Um, not much cool things going on, but see, I'm gonna make this, another one over here, twice its size. That's why I don't have any, that's why I don't have two studs right here. Um, so imagine this house with another one right beside it, double, with two windows. That's what mine's gonna look like. So, yeah, um, let's get started. I don't have my hot glue gun plugged in, so I'm just going to demonstrate. There will be a part two on this, on how to do the walls. I'm going to do this with big popsicle sticks. Jumbo. You can just get the small ones for a dollar at some places um walmart it'll probably cost more if you go to a general dollar general or something like that okay so i'm just gonna do this sideways for you guys these are bigger than usual ones those are small these are double the size you would just get those two, put two studs, like that, okay, and that would be the house, if you do it, Here's a good demonstration. You always want to see these corners right here. Well, you always want to put these sticks under these so you can just line your popsicle sticks sideways because they're not tall enough. To go stand up by themselves this way, they have to go this way. Um, so each of one popsicle stick can hold twelve of these that way. So thank you and look for part two.